Let's check it out. Homegirl Biscuit. Homegirl Biscuit. Right here. Homegirl Biscuit up in the club. Fabulous. He's Home Skittly Biscuit. That's our line. Yeah. Home Skittly Biscuit. Right? Yeah. It's on. It's right? on. It's on. Touch in the hand, Rob. Touch in the hand. This is Car from Flash TV. And we're on Hawthorne Boulevard in Port Oregon. This is where we're going. This is the store. Follow Bree this way. Whoa. This is Donnie. So nice to meet you. I think you're going to go upstairs now and check out that sewing school. Come here. You ready, Donnie? What? All right, guys. So this is Bree. These are some of the full life all stars. I'm pretty sorry, sorry. Hey, you guys be careful with everything, okay? How is the sewing process done on these machines? It's, I guess it depends on what it is that you're going to make. But if you look right here, this is the presser foot and here's the needle. And so you're going to take your fabric and I can show you actually on this. You take your fabric and you put it between the presser foot and what's called the throat plate. Bring the presser foot down and at the bottom there's a pedal, just like you're driving. And you put your foot down and the machine sews. So I'm just going to sew a little bit of this, but you'll see that when I take it out of the machine, the pleats won't come out anymore. So I just sewed them in. And so that's how the sewing machine process works. How long have you been sewing? I've been sewing for about 10 years now. And I just opened the shop three months ago, so. Wait, well, so why are some of the sewing projects you've done here? Mostly we have classes, but um, I just finished a big gown. It's called a steampunk gown, which is a type of, it's, a, it's an aesthetic, it's a clothing aesthetic. And I just finished that, which was pretty, it was pretty cool. That was a pretty cool project that we just did. What are some of the classes that you teach? We teach lots of classes. We have machine basics classes, and classes for kids, and uh, quilting classes, and what else? We have Men Up and Sew, which is a class for just men. It's pretty awesome. Yeah. Why should people learn to sew? Because it's so much better to fix your clothes than it is to throw them out. And plus, if you have something that's in your head that you want to sew, uh, once you learn the skills to sew, then you can make anything that you want. And why wouldn't you rather make something that you can wear than go out and buy something? What is it about Portland that helps a small business like this? 
this space specifically, there's such a community that we're building in this building uh, with all of with all of the businesses that are in here, um, and also just the people that are in the area. They want to come and they want to hang out with other people that are in the area and learn how to sew with them. And we have community open socials on Sunday, which is it's our most popular class that we have, um, and it's an open studio time where people can just come in and they can. People can come in and they can learn from each other and they can work on their projects together and then just talk about other things that are going on in the community. I had someone come in earlier today and tell me about a street fair that's happening a few blocks away uh, in two weeks. And so it's that kind of thing that really makes the space important uh, for for the community and really gratifying to to own it and to be able to present that to the community. Cool. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. What do you think? How do you like the store? Cool. Nice, it's cool, it's awesome, it's totally a rattle. Rock. <laughs> oh, I'm joking! Rock. <laughs> What you got there, Maurice? Hold it up. Zigzag. That's how you get the embroidery. It's nice, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you can use zigzags. And... Huh? Awesome, Donnie. Boom. Can I have a high five? Yeah. We're awesome. Thank you. Thanks for coming, guys. All right, on three. So cool. Very nice, Maurice. Hey, Fred, though. Thanks so much for coming, guys. Well, man, best of me. You did it, buddy. Best of me. There you are. Good job, pal. <laughs> <laughs> 